Our Global Air and Space Chiefs Conference this year focuses on deterrence and the importance of increasing our level of integration and enhancing our interoperability with our key allies and partners to improve the deterrent effect we create. When we consider the multiple and multiplying threats facing us, air and space power have a unique role to play in deterring aggression. It's always preferable to deter conflict from happening rather than having to deal with the consequence of conflict once it's started. A key aspect of deterrence is the proven ability of air and space power to defend what we value. Ultimately though, we must be prepared to defeat those who choose to use aggression against us, wherever they are and whenever they try to harm us. For our air forces, that means we need to be ready to fly and fight. To be most effective, air and space power needs to be integrated with the other three operational domains, land, sea and cyberspace. Multi-domain operations executed effectively will allow us to overwhelm and outmaneuver our adversaries. By doing this alongside our allies, we will enhance our credibility, capability and capacity. This is why events such as our Global Air and Space Chiefs Conference are so important. The source of our key strength is in the breadth and depth of our alliances and partnerships, and in what we can achieve when we think, plan and then act together. I look forward to seeing you at, your, at our conference next week.